Hello everyone, I am Nina Zulbe, Assistant Professor in Computer Department from AISSMS IOIT, Pune. Today we will learn about the Venn diagram representation on different sets. The shaded, the brown shaded region is A intersection B that we can see here. The two sets are overlapping to each other A and B and the shaded brown region shows that it is an intersection part. We can show three sets also which are interacting to each other. So right hand side diagram shows the three main diagram on three sets and the shaded portion shows the part A intersection B. These are the more examples on Venn diagram. Here on left hand side diagram A union B is shown by the Venn diagram and right hand side diagram the A complement intersection B complement that are shown using the Venn diagram. The shaded part is the first box square is shown A intersection A complement intersection B complement. So the number of elements which are not in A and B. So here whole shaded part is showing by Venn diagram the number of elements in A and B. So A union B and the darker orange color shows it is A intersection B. So the common elements from A and B. There are fundamental, fundamental laws of algebra of sets. So we will see those laws. So first law is idempotent law. It is A union A is equal to A and A intersection A is equal to A. Identity law A union phi is A and A intersection union is equal to A. Commutative law A union B equal to B union A and A intersection B equal to B intersection A. Associative law so that is A union B union C equal to A union B union C. Then distributive law it is distribution over intersection and distribution over union it is a union b intersection c will be a union b intersection a union c same for union then de morgan's law a union b its complement is a complement intersection b complement and that will be same for intersection so next topic is the inclusion and exclusion principle so for any finite set the number of set denote by the number of objects in a set S. So if we take the example if A set set A contains 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 elements and set B contains 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 elements then number of elements in A are 7 and number of elements in B are 6. So we can find out the number of elements in A union B by inclusion exclusion principle and that will be given by the formula number of element in A plus number of element in B minus the common elements from A and B that is A intersection B. So here the number of elements in A are 7. So the inclusion exclusion theorem we can show by the Venn diagram also. So here the two sets are given A and B and the intersection is given by the shaded yellow color that is the number of elements common from A and B are 5. Then A complement is given that is the number of elements in B only that is again 5 and the B complement that is 10 it is given that the yellow shaded part in a third diagram that is 10. So here A union B is given by all the elements in A and all the elements in B minus the common elements are in A and B. So it is a Venn diagram on three sets. So here we can 
शो ए इंटरसेक्शन बी इंटरसेक्शन सी दैट इज द मिडल इंटरसेक्शन पार्ट ऑफ ऑल थ्री सेट्स दीज आर टू बी कॉम्प्लीमेंट वी कैन फाइंड आउट द बी कॉम्प्लीमेंट सो द एलिमेंट्स विच आर नॉट इन बी बट द एलिमेंट्स विच आर इन यूनिवर्सल सेट एंड ए एंड सी सो दैट आर गिवेन बाय टेन प्लस फोर प्लस टू प्लस थ्री A intersection B is all. Also, we can find out that is three plus two. And B union C, we can find out with all the elements in B and all the elements in C. So there are elements three, six, then four, two, and the common element is that is two, one. So that are equal to eighteen. So in this way, we can show the number of sets. by graphical representation using venn diagram how the sets are interact how the sets are overlap so that we can represent by the venn diagram thank you